guys, it's Flo and today I'm going to be doing a what's in my beach bag plus some essentials and um, I want to show you this video because a lot of people don't know what to put in their beach bag and I just wanted to show you guys what I'm putting in my beach bag and also to like, you know, connect with the summer train. If you want to check out my swimsuit video, it will be linked right here and also down in the down bar. Let's get started. Okay, so first my beach bag is from Beer Bradley, which I know doesn't sound like a beachy brand or whatever, but um, I don't know, I like to use it at the beach because it has a lot of storage. Okay, so the first thing in my beach bag is a towel because I really need this when I get out of the water or just to lay on and tan because it gets cold and then you also don't want to be laying in the sand because that's like disgusting and uh, no. Okay, so the next thing is this little makeup bag which I just keep a couple of makeup necessities or something like that. So first what I keep in here is a eyebrow thing just to make these always on fleek even though they never are. Um, then I keep eyebrow gel because again, these things need to be tamed as much as they can, but you know, whatever. Next, I have some mascara just in case my mascara bleeds and I just need more before I go out or something. I also have some eyeshadow just in case I want to go out after the beach and I can just swipe it on my eyelids. Then I also have some chapstick because you can get sunburned on your lips if you didn't know. My mom got it once and it was awful and totally rough. And last but not least, I have two hair ties to pull my hair up so the water doesn't make my hair all gross and then I feel it on my neck and it just makes me so uncomfortable. So the next thing in my beach bag is just in case I get hungry or something. So I just have some goldfish because these are really filling even though they're really unhealthy. It's all gooch, you know. Okay, so the next thing I have in my beach bag is my GoPro and I recently got this and it is life changing. It has the best footage. It's even better quality than the camera I'm using now. So just imagine that real quick. Okay, and also I'll put some clips in here and then if you also wanna see the, some clips of me using the GoPro, you can check out my last video, which was a DIY flower crown for the Lana concert. And then you get to see some clips of Lana, ooh, and then also me, Jackie, and Cliff at the concert. So my next thing are my Ray-Bans because you really need to protect your eyes from the sun. And so I just have these Ray-Bans with a Vineyard Vines thing on it. I didn't choose the Vineyard Vines Life. Vineyard Vines Life chose me, but. Okay, so the next thing I have in my beach bag is some makeup remover, just in case I wear mascara to the beach and then when I get in the water, it like runs and it gets disgusting. And also, these, I know like this is kind of like stupid use for them, but when you get sand on your feet and you're like about to go in the car and then you're like, oh my gosh, this is repulsive, you can just wipe it off with some makeup remover wipes and then it's just off and then you're less uncomfortable. Okay, so the next thing that I have in my beach bag is a speaker that I got. I think it's from Five Below, but it's a really good speaker and it's also really good if you're sitting at the beach and your friends want to be listening to the same music, but like the wind is loud. I don't even know. I'm just making up a scenario here. But anyway, it's a really good speaker and I like to use it every time I'm at the beach. The next thing that I have in my bag is body lotion because every time I stand in the sand, although it's like exfoliating and stuff, it really dries out my feet or my hands or something like that. So I like to moisturize when I'm at the beach or else I feel like really dry and like it's really uncomfortable. I also keep a brush in my bag because you don't want your hair to be gross. In the side pocket, as you can see right here, I keep my phone in my wallet, even though this probably isn't a good place to keep it considering anyone could steal it out of there. I think it's really like, you know, easy to get to. So yep. Like for what's on my iPhone because I really have been wanting to film it, but I don't know if you guys want to. So prove that you guys want to want me to do it by liking it. Last but not least, I have this aloe vera just in case it's been like a really hot day at the beach and I get totally crusty and burnt and this really soothes my burns. I don't know if that's what happens with you guys too, but I don't know, I really like it. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to comment, like, subscribe, comment down below which your three main summer essentials are for the beach. Bye! Jackson.